Concordia Pioneer Cemetery. Um, this cemetery is being maintained by the descendants and friends of the Pioneer families who settled in this area in the late 1840s. Oh. Now, this is a very, very tiny cemetery here, folks. So let's have a look. Jonathan Christopher Christoph Eim I can't read that look how old those headstones are oh look there's a little park bench Sorry people, I can't actually read the gravestones, so you can just pause the video and read them for yourself if you want. A lot of these are unmarked, it looks like. What does this one say? Concordia Pioneer Cemetery Trust. This plaque is dedicated to the memory of our forebears who immigrated from Germany in the late 1840s in search of freedom and a new way of life. Having said that, I would like to pay my respects to the Ghana people of the Adelaide Plains, the traditional owners of this land. I pay my respects to elders, past, present and future, and I recognise this land was never ceded. So many unmarked graves here. tree I think yep oh. at least the sun isn't glaring and I can actually see where my camera is pointing I said I can't read the gravestones, so you're going to have to. Oh, there. Oh, no. I thought I saw another family relation.
another unmarked grave. I find this interesting. I wonder if this was actually built for purpose or like a like the iron, instead of an iron gate, just a stone wall or a stone perimeter. I don't know. I've never seen a perimeter for a headstone quite like that. Sheep in the background. My sheep. Oh, here's a cute one. Um, no, I still can't read it, but. There you go. I think that's an angel. Interesting side note, I have a video of a walkthrough and paranormal investigation of the Conzag House. I am going to put a card in the end screen and a link in the description if you want to go and see the Conzag footage. I might even splice the three videos together and make one and create one big video including the footage from um, the cemetery. Okay, what's down here? And, yep, that is the extent of the cemetery. As you can see, it is very small. and holds a lot of history. Okay, that's it for me for now. We are going to our next port of call, which is, I think, Sedan. Okay, hooroo.